Yu-Gi-Oh RPG games that should have fusions. Before we start, subscribe, hit that notification bell, like, share, leave a come below. Tell me what think about this Yu-Gi-Oh video. With that being said, it's time to duel. Fusions. In both of these games, there has been many monsters that could be compared to what we call their fusions. Throughout the many years, I have been putting a video about all mental reality duels of Yu-Gi-Oh. I mean, they have done some before, but they really not, you know, capture the moment of letting us play in at least the semi or the finals of this whole thing. That comes to world championships. I'll get back on that though. And then what got me doing this is Dragon Margania. <laughs> Sorry. Dragon Margania Master. Instead of a warrior, they got a sp spellcaster. Hmm. Wow. I'm going to leave a description down below for a video because that's what got me the idea. But for the many monsters you have known that could have been a fusion of any type or a fusion material of any type, you think it was awesome. Right? Right. Because one... When Yu Gi Oh first started, we thought there was no fusion. We thought it was just monsters we played on the field, summon at any time, say, hey, I win. Hmm. Yeah, right. So, let me say this. The first movie of Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 0 where Yu-Gi summoned a fusion of Meteor Dragon and Red-Eyes Black Dragon created Meteor Black Dragon and his friend not Joey, not Rex Raptor but his friend, childhood friend holding that monster but we thought we'd never seen a fusion like that before, but when Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon came out, three dragons, legendary type monsters, we thought we'd never see in the game as a ritual monster. But Master of Dragon Soldier, I mean, oh yeah, Knight, sorry, Master of Dragon Knight, whew. Warrior and Dragon fused together. We thought that'd never be the day. No, seriously, we thought we'd never be the day. But in the game, you get your sacred cards. Ultimate Dragon Ritual is where you summon the Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. You don't need now. The only thing you need is one Blue Eyes. This card. And that ultimate dragon, that's it. Also, in many RPG games, you thought you'd never see where the monsters could come to life. The characters come to life. It's really a shame sometimes, you know. Really it is. I mean, in both Yu-Gi-Oh! Save Cards and Reshare of Destruction, where they have their elemental disadvantages, especially the four in particular, Light, Fiend, Dream, Shadow. I mean, come on, think about it. Even when it comes to fusions, I think Joey was amped up during the Battle City series 
arc even where he fused alligator swords and baby dragon made alligator sword dragon but time wizard of tomorrow oh i mean come on who would have thought that this fool would create his own fusion That magic knight. That flame swordsman. Even thousand dragon. All fusion. I mean, come on. What did I just say? Thousand dragon. Fusion. This boy done summoned monsters in which you thought. Oh my god. Ain't he supposed to use a fusion? But in the games, fusion, thousand dragon, fusion, flame swordsman, fusion, but in the game, it's a regular monster. I mean, well, well, what were you trying to pull here? No? Because not only that, the true first time fusion was when Seto Kaiba bound his prototype dual disc. When he fused Battle Ox and Mystic Horseman to make Rapid Horseman. Then... The fusion of Blast Gold Dragon. Raz Black Dragon with I think Skull Fiend, Fiend Skull. <laughs> I forgot all the monsters out of years. I haven't played Yu-Gi-Oh! in a long time, forgive me. Then Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon is where we first saw this monster, is where he would try to get into the castle at Duelist Kingdom. Seto Kai would try to get into the castle at Duelist Kingdom to save his brother. I mean, the design, the ritual was crazy, but doing a share of destruction? Huh. Then five god, five-headed dragon, or in the game, five god dragon, or every deed for short. This is something wrong here. I don't know where to put it, but it's something wrong. Cause you 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 won't need a light monster to beat this guy. And what light monster would be more better? It's the master of Dragon Knight. From fusion to regular monster. But you know what's real crazy? In Rochelle of Destruction, we just saw this alligator sword dragon being a regular monster, not a fusion. They put fusion monsters in these games. And yet, we wonder why. Why not just still do a fusion? Instead of making regular monsters. Poor Dark Paladin. Poor Dark Paladin. Then let me talk to you about something. You know how the monsters in the game have their abilities? The goddess of the wise eye could be an effect monster that do fusion. Now you're wondering. Remember how every time 
you have attack, defend, sacrifice, and effect for this. Now, under sacrifice is effect. And if you was to use her as a polymerization effect monster and just say activate effect it could fuse any of those monsters together in the game based on what monsters on the field right right I'm not wrong am I cause one but why the ultimate dragon that less a soldier Master of Dragon Knight. Or in the game they call Master of Dragon Soldier. Cause see, not only that, there's a a certain sequence to unlock where if you battle against Yugi, Yami Yugi, aka a Tim, you have and a ritual card that allows you to summon Master of Dragon Soldier. Instead of the ritual. The Black Lust of Night ritual. In my next video, I'm going to see who's on a better comparison between the two. Master of Dragon Knight or Master Megania I mean, dragon, whatever you call it. <laughs> With that being said, I'm your boy Chris Blackthorn Harris. Oh, one more thing. I think we need to get a petition to upgrade the fusions for the fusions in Yu Gi Oh! Dawn, Yu Gi Oh! Rush Duel Battle. Dawn of the Battle Royal. Second video I'm going to do it on. Then third video I'm going to do it on. Is where I talk about how they should bring you give the cards back. Once more, I'll be woke back to Harris. When it comes to knowing my cards of Yu-Gi-Oh. It's always time to duel.